Hi everyone, welcome back. I hope you're enjoying the videos. If you are, please consider subscribing. Also, please hit that like button. It really helps the channel to grow and show YouTube that we are a channel worth promoting. All right, so it's a, it's a kind of exciting day today, but also a little bit of a letdown. We, we have another clutch of eggs. It's corn snake clutch number one. It is wild style, our extreme reverse Okatee to our Ultramel Annery. So with this clutch, she laid eight eggs. They're literally sitting right here beside me. Um, unfortunately, uh, it looks like she totally slugged out. So we're going to get a set up the camera and kind of show what slugs look like and see if we can later do a comparison. Um, now, I'm not going to be candling the eggs because visually seeing when you inspect the difference between a slug and a good egg is important. I'm going to try and exemplify what a slug looks like. Now, some of these eggs do have internal markings. Uh, most likely it's from a dead embryo. Uh, but just in case we will be throwing them in the incubator or just on the off chance, but there's little to no hope for that. All right, let's get to work. Okay, here is the mom wild style. As I said, she's an extreme Okatee. Now she will be getting a brand new um, box to stay in. Um, this bedding will be thrown away. She'll get a new water bowl, everything. This will be cleaned and sanitized because she didn't lay the eggs in her lay box. The smell is in her container completely and I don't want to have to worry about her being defensive forever and thinking that she still has eggs. So this will be completely changed out. All right, let's let me put her up and I'll bring the eggs over and show you what they look like. So here are our eggs. Number one off the bat is this tiny egg. This egg is about an inch long. It's yellow. And it's obviously way smaller than the others. So this egg is very obviously a slug. Next up, and this is what will be what most of these look like, is this egg. For this slug, you notice how it is not rounded. It's actually got points on it on both ends, and you can see the reflection is very waxy. Because of that, this also is very obviously a slug. Now for these eggs here, these are a little bit different. If you look closely, this egg is severely windowed. You have just this small amount of calcification right here, but the rest of it is a pure window. Now this might be a good egg, but because of the windowing, most likely it won't survive. On top of that, it's yellowed in appearance, and it's also waxy looking. Because of that waxy film, most likely this is, is a slug. This egg, again, has severe windowing and also has that waxy coating and is yellow. And for each of these, you can see there is the severe windowing and that waxy color and also that slight yellowing. Now, this one only has the small amount of calcification right there. The rest of it's a window and it's pointed. This also most likely is going to be a slug. This one actually has a lot of calcification, but because of its that waxy coating and it being yellow, most likely a slug. And this is the case for all of these. So unfortunately, corn snake clutch number one is mostly, mostly a bust. And unfortunately that happens. Now on the good note, 
we have most definitely our other corn snake clutch. It has uh, gone into its prelay shed in the last few days. Uh, bull snake clutch number two has also had its prelay shed and she started nosing around, getting her nest ready. So we should be having more egg videos coming soon. Remember, please like and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching the video. If you like what we've done, please remember to subscribe. And also, consider checking out either the playlist or the video that is shown on the screen. Have a great day. Bye.